Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Pokemon Advanced Adventures. The last episode we arrived here in the village of ghosts and um, we took on a little job from an old man who lives in this town to scale the tower and rescue his prized Gengar. And that's exactly what we are going to do. Please Johnny restore salvation in town and rescue poor Gengar. So... We've got to find this tower. Oh, Christ. We've got to fight him, haven't we? Okay. Ben's here. Johnny, you again. You just never give up, do you? I'll wipe you out right here, right now. So we're battling our nemesis, Ben. He's gone from being rival to nemesis now. And he's got a Nuzleaf, and it's at level 25. So let's rock it, rock and roll it with an ember from our CK9. Two, two embers and down goes that Nuzleaf. Sergeant Awol is up to level 16 now, I think. And here's a Jolteon now. We want to send in Yanis for that. Because Yanis is rock typing means his electric attacks are going to be, um, you know, between useless and, and terrible. Thunder Wave will work, obviously, that's um, a given, but as soon as we get we get a shot off in, with Rock Throw. Whoa! Okay, I thought Rock Throw would finish it, but alright, we'll use Toxic again. So now we poison the thing. I'm going to use a healing item here. Just to keep tro tro keep tropius in the battlefield. I'll also use leech seed if I can. We've got him leeched now as well. So of course, while he's here taking poison and leech seed damage, we'll throw stones at him and miss. But the poison will finish him off. Tropius up to level 18. Sergeant Awol up to level 16. And in comes the Noctowl. Rock types are super effective against um, flying types. But it's, st it's still got like 10 levels above on us, so. So we will go down to Rock Throw. But obviously we've got Pikachu at level 19 who can probably handle his own. That's probably something that can happen. Confusion took a chunk of damage off Pikachu. It's using Reflect though, which is obviously something that's going to be somewhat worrying. Confusion will finish Pikachu. So I'm going to send in the T-1000. With a metal claw to clean your clock. T1000 up to level two, th up to level 20. He wants to learn detect, but I don't want it to. And he's got a Numel. That one's got Gyarados written, or Gyarados or Seekanine written all over it. I'm gonna let Gyarados take it though, because Gyarados could be out of the party after this battle. Because Seekanine covers water types, and um, if I if I if I get if I get the Gengar at the top of the tower, I will be using it. Hum, you got lucky. Better say your prayers, because now I'm coming for you. So yeah, Ben is still wandering around the town with weak leveled Pokemon even though he rules the world at the moment. I, I'm not entirely sure why he uh, why he does that. You know, why he uh, keeps appearing and um, engaging in battles with us when frankly uh, he rules the world at this point. So let's go up the tower. It's called the Haunted Tower so I'm expecting that to be for a reason. We've got the Sylph Scope which means we can fight ghosts, but I'm going to avoid doing that by using a repel.
We're going to battle some um, haunted little women up here now. Channel at Amanda sent out a ghastly at level 22. We'll just hit it with Ember Attack. It's using Spike to drop our Ember's energy, but that won't be a major issue. Sergeant Awol's getting a chunk of it, a chunk of the XP from, from me fighting all these levels the first one, you know. Seems like there's an item for you to pick up everywhere at the stairs. We've got an escape rope, so this is how we're getting out of here, obviously. Uh, let's go up here now. Over that way, we use a repel. There's no sense in me catching a ghastly when I'm going to be, I'm likely picking up a Gengar at the end of the area. So, we've got a great ball to catch it in. And another channeler. This one's got a Sable Eye at level 22. Rinse and repeat, really, when it comes to fighting the ghost. Certainly doesn't seem as if there's any sense in um, doing anything other than just hitting them with Ember and watching them go down. I need water pulls on the just call the save up on Ember. Given that Ember, we lost the majority of our Embers, this is about pissing Gatsby with Spite on floor one. Got an item behind us, so it must be something. She's sending out a horn. Turn is it? Oh my God! Is it level 27? Okay, wow. Um, Ember. Seeking I went down. Uh, pursuit. Yeah, of course. Dark type. Super effective. I don't think he can hit me with his ghost moves either, so... T-1000 could well be the ghost killer in this area. Since Seeker Iron's gone down, we need something to do the battle in, so I'm gonna let my ghost killer do it. T-143. So let's go up here, up this way. Wrong route. We want to go. Keep that escape route so we can get out of here at the end. I'll get it right in a minute. Right down to the bottom and left. And then up. And that takes me in front of this channeler. Who's channeler Ivory. Who can use pursuit to help me. I don't think it's ghost type moves can touch me, so I'm pretty much at ease with this guy. The Fury Swipe thing can do all that much to a steel type. Right, this one's just your danger, this one could be an issue. Ghost type though, super effective, down it goes. And the dust skull. Running out of pursuits though. Far off the top now. If I remember this area, if it, well, if it's anything like it was in the original games, then there's only one more floor, I think. I 
and mischievous. Stonish ain't gonna work on a dark type, love. Oh god, Spike's gonna drop my pursuits. HP in it. We only got two left. After pursuit's gone, I don't know. It's gonna have to be uh, type moves, I suppose, like water and stuff. I don't think Metal Claw's gonna work, is it? Oh bloody hell it did work and all. Oh bloody hell it does work, alright. <laughs> so we're still in this. Straight at the top of the stairs we're engaged by another channeler. Haunter and Mistrevis, so we're going T1000 Indiana. I have Metal Claw and Toxic Poison, I think, will work in this battle. Because the rock type ain't going to do any good against a um, ghost. The T1000 Metal Claw is enough to take out the Haunter. So we poison the shop hit. It's a pretty bad poison. Two one hit, two one thousand hit to pretty aggressive metal claw and they're both now poisoned. Metal claw on the shop hit, down it goes. This confused ray is going to confuse me, but rock throw finished off. What well, a bit funny then. <laughs> My bad. Anyway, we go across here. So you can fight the ghost Pokemon in here as well. So if you want to catch a ghost Pokemon, this is the place to do it. I think it's the only place to do it actually, but we've got a full heal. So bring pursuit back. battle we can have. We're another channeler. He's got a dust skull level 25. Using the same tactic as the last one. Trying to confuse me and get me to myself. Which didn't work. Then we'll use Pursuit to wipe it out, finish it off, put it down. We've got one more um, channel to fight, this one here. So we've got three Pokemon, one of them is a Sableye. Metal Claw, finish that one off. Metal Claw will obviously finish it off. Obviously another Metal Claw will take some damage, will deal, deal plenty of damage to the other Sableye. Down. We'll go up here and we'll have to battle a bunch of these trainers. 
in order to get near the Gengar, I assume. A Shuffit and a Sableye. Obviously, not sure it'll work on Yana, but. This metal claw takes out the shop pit. So we'll cl clock him in the head with the metal claw, the poison will finish him off. in a moment I'm just gonna take a breather here's the pokeball let's do this I'm gonna make a quick save you never know so we're gonna attack this Gengar that wow it's blue it's an ice type Gengar so it's using ice moves so we've got Pursuit. Ice Punch has taken out T1000. Ah, oh, the pig doing on this. He's weak enough to only use like low level moves that won't. Oh, yeah. All that could happen, of course. Janus, go! Sending guard us. Dragon Mage. Oh, getting us. Oh, no! Let's go back to our safe state because I want that Gengar. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Not sure it ain't gonna work against me with my dark moves. Will Metal Claw work on a Gengar? Hopefully, hopefully. Oh, we won it, KO'd it, balls. Let's try that again. Obviously, Curse is gonna cut his HP down. Oh, I used to see. I'm killed by the Curse, but sending Yana so he can take a turn. I'm gonna throw a Pokeball because I'm gonna save the Great Ball. But we caught it in the in the ball. So we want a nickname for a cold goat, a cold spirit, don't we? Um, now I could I could go with um, on the rocks, but it's a ghost, um, an ice ghost, a cold ghost, a frozen ghost, um, a frozen ghost, ghost, frozen cold ice. Um, I think I know what I'm going with. If you're a wrestling fan, you'll get this gag. Nah, 
last two. I can't, I can't. It's too short for Chili McFreeze. I have Stone Cold. So we've got a Gengar called Stone Cold. Not made of stone, that doesn't work. Um I I don't know, hang on, I'll be back in a minute. Ice shade, that'll do. Now ice shade is obviously and we're out of the um ghost tower. Now if we go and see that old man, but first we're gonna put Gengar in our party, so Go to the Pokemon Center and pick Gengar up. Who are we dropping there? Just like that. Let's heal up. we do in terms of positioning then 21 21 21 19 19 21 24 gonna keep it on no, I'm not actually. I'm not putting T1000. Because he's the only one here who I can guarantee you ain't leaving, really, to be honest. Because if I get be better subs, then I'm going to use them. So. We live in the east, I think he said, the old geezer. So. Let's see if we can find his house. We got HMO3, which is surf. So let's teach that to C canine. Might as well get rid of water pulse. Teach him surf. I think this is the old man's house here. Tell you what, you saved my Gengar. Johnny, I cannot thank you enough. Johnny, I'm going to give you a very special reward. This Pokemon is known for its courage. Train it well, it will evolve into something powerful. Take it with you on your journey. The name will bring a smile to my face every time I hear it from this day forth. Take down Ben, restore peace to this continent. And he's given us a rufflet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of my Tropius and put rufflet in my party. Because roughly it will evolve into Braviary and that can be my flyer. Roughly it evolves into Braviary so we can teach him fly. So I do have fly. Obviously Tropius can't learn it because he's got a rock typing now. Because roughly it does evolve into Braviary and that'll be a useful flying type. A type coverage we don't actually have at the moment. It's also a lot stronger than our Pikachu. Pikachu's probably going to be the next one to be, to be got rid of I expect. So here we go, we can we can now head past this chap here and off into the next route. But we'll do that next time on Pokemon Advanced Adventures. Thank you guys for watching and see you then. Goodbye.